After a recovery asthma trip, our hero woke relaxed and ready for what's next. With some coffee in his craw, in came the familiar sound of a message. This message was different though. This message was from Stanley the Fusser. After some awkward greetings, Stanley said they wanted to meet up at the tomb of the fun employed at 8 p.m. Our hero conflictingly agreed. As our hero made his way he was stopped by a dealer named Slippery George George. He was selling something called a saber light. One dollar for you, for sale, for sale, for sale. He swore it had one million lumens and would last a year. I bought one for one dollar. As he approached the tomb night was falling. He could see it was the right one by the fun symbol displayed over the entrance. He entered the tomb and turned on his light. Looking around for Stanley and Susanna Patricia George. It was too quiet. He felt uneasy. As if something was amiss. His spidey senses tingled. He sent them a text. What the hells you told me you would meet me at the tomb of the fun employed. I am here. There was no reply. It was then he heard it. It was Cat the Cat. Our hero was set up again. His saber flickered and lost all function. Cat the Cat attacked. Our hero lay defeated. Was he gone? Or was it all a dream? This email was sent the following day. Mocking and taunting again. Bra! 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 Exoro! Exoro! The man of the people!